All right, welcome back. Uh, good Thursday evening, everybody. Once again, uh, the sunset should be pretty good in the western part of the state, including uh, around the Great Falls area. Warm temperatures today made it up into the low 60s in Great Falls, and currently it is 54. Kind of hard to believe just a few days ago we were talking about statewide record cold and record snow here, but alas, we do live in Montana. 45 degrees in Helena. It is actually warmer up on top of McDonald Pass than it is out in the Helena Valley right now because of a minor inversion that uh, we've been dealing with here over the last few days. That's why Helena and Missoula both at 45. The rest of the state, yeah, it's a little cooler up northeast Montana, but still 60 degrees right now in Livingston. The wind not so bad out there right now. Enjoy it because that wind is really going to ramp up tomorrow. Uh, thus, uh, we've got a high wind warning for the Rocky Mountain front out through central Montana. Windy tomorrow morning, but it really picks up in intensity through the afternoon and the evening. And once the front goes through Helen around four or five o'clock, that's when the wind in the valley will really pick up. The good news is this wind should get rid of some of that nasty air west of the Continental Divide. Very windy tomorrow evening all the way into Saturday morning. And this weekend really should be very nice. The wind dies down on Saturday and Sunday won't be that windy either. Uh, now the high wind warning though, Cup Bank, Chester, down through places like Dutton and Great Falls out into Judith Basin County does not include Helena. It will be a windy day, just in that high wind warning criteria. Likely we won't see a gust up to 50, 60, 70 miles per hour in Helena like you potentially will see into uh, the areas off towards the north. Uh, kind of a tough day to tow a trailer if uh, you're traveling on any north-south routes, including Interstate 15. And there's that air stagnation advisory. By the way, Helena, the air quality is moderate right now because of uh, the minor inversion. Precipitation, a eh, little spits going on into parts of the Dakotas. And then also what was Hurricane Zeta is now moving up into the northeast with some rain and yeah, even a little snow up into New England. So for Montana, though, uh, tonight's a pretty night. Again, the sunset right now is uh, very, very nice. It will be for the next half hour, 45 minutes. It's almost a full moon. We get a full moon on Halloween, so very big, bright moon out there tonight. Tomorrow, a mostly sunny day, but you're probably looking at the rain and mountain snow working its way down the Continental Divide and the Rocky Mountain Front through the afternoon and the evening. We could see a couple of rain showers, brief rain showers around 4, 5, 6 o'clock in Helena. Some snow up on the Continental Divide. It's a brief passing shower. It may come down pretty uh, heavily or intense for a few minutes but that's about it. Then we clear things out going through Friday night into Saturday. Maybe a little breezy central eastern Montana, but almost calm conditions uh, in the western part of the state. For tonight, again, it's a pretty night, pretty sunset. Temperatures not too cold, close to average. Uh, most lows, most towns should have lows in the upper 20s to the lower 30s here. Helena with temperatures dropping down below the freezing point could be a little spotty icy in a few areas. For tomorrow, certainly not icy. We'll have high temperatures up into the 50s and the 60s once again. There's that front that could bring a few showers to the Helena area tomorrow afternoon round again, three, four o'clock for Saturday. A couple things going on here should be a nice day, a little on the cooler side, but uh, the last a few Halloween's have been on the snowier side, but it's Halloween. And then after your trick or treating, safely uh, turn those clocks back on Saturday night. It is the 49 hour weekend coming up here as we uh, fall back. Daylight saving time comes to an end Sunday, November 1st. How many November 1st look like this with sunny skies and temperatures up into the 50s? And if you like that uh, late fall warmth, it gets even better on Monday 60s and 70s. I do think a few records will be broken coming up here on Monday. Maybe not for Helena, but we'll likely hold uh, out into the 60s there. But uh, looking unusual here, especially after all the record cold and snow that we've had. Uh, so pretty pleasant. Enjoy the 50s and the 60s and the sunshine through the weekend. Great Falls, yeah, windy tomorrow, but still 64, a little cooler on Saturday. Great Falls likely tying, at least tying the record high coming up on Monday. And things start to go downhill late next week. It does look like the first full weekend of November. Winter returns. Sounds about right. Thanks a lot for that, Curtis. And coming up next, you might.